What up, Hobiscuits? It's your girl, Skitten, back at it again. First and foremost, I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are staying safe and sanitized. I also want you to know that if you were at Houston Night 2 and Club Renaissance, and you were the person who was in there ripping ass repeatedly, you are going to hell. You will be dealt with. Because that's fucked up. That's disgusting. Why would you do that? Like, we're all here trying to have a good time, waiting on Beyonce. She was two hours late, which, you know, is her prerogative. That's the queen right there. But why would you make a time that is already fraught with dissatisfaction and discomfort? Why would you add your nasty ass dead bowel scent to that? Why would you do that? Like you might, like your insides might be fucked up. You might need to go to the doctor cause that shit was nasty. It was so, oh my God, it was so upsetting and it was so disgusting. Like you're lucky a lot of us in there had fans cause you would have got jumped for real, for real. We would have, we would have been able to follow our noses to your smelly booty hole and beat you the fuck up. And that's what we really should have done. Cause it was disgusting. <sighs> But other than that, Beyonce was great. <laughs> Around people, you're just gonna shit your pants. Like that's crazy. That's nuts. That's insane behavior. And really disrespectful, to be honest. A personal affront. Anyway, let me stop talking about nasty things. Today, we are here to watch Daily Juicy Memes. Probably just as juicy as that person's farts. Anyway. Super excited to see what this video has in store for us. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. You co-worker, how is it here? Me, this is a land of dreams and madness. <laughs> it's great. People complimenting my slim body shape. Me with an undiagnosed food allergy that gives me uncontrolled diarrhea several days Damn. a week. I think about that a lot though, because when I was younger, like back when Chavez and I first met, I was really skinny. I was maybe 120 pounds, maybe. I was very, very skinny, girl. Um, but it was because like, I didn't really eat anything except for eggs and cereal. And like, I don't know, sometimes my friends bought me food and stuff. And it wasn't because my parents didn't provide food, but just once I got old enough to not have to eat the food that my parents provided, I didn't. Cause it was all like fucking Gorton's fish, the little square fish patties and rice and microwave lasagnas and stuff like it was not great you know what i mean so once i got to the point where i could choose what i ate baby baby i was eating fucking frosted flakes eggs bagels that was really it that's basically it. And then like a bunch of junk food. And my metabolism was a lot better back then too. So, but once I started eating real food, whoo, your girl gained some weight. Your girl got big. <laughs> Dogs, when they realize that the best foods were intentionally made to not be good for them. What a rip off. That's kind of messed up, yeah. I don't want to be mean here, but this dog looks like a big dummy. <laughs> Coalition bangs Napoleon to the Isle of Elba. Napoleon nine months later. <laughs> I'm back, bitch. My grandma's 17 year old cat falling from balcony. Oh God. It's her fourth time, beside the age, still survives. Damn. When you sneeze, while guarding Troy's walls in the wooden horse replies with this, come again. <laughs> like what's happening? They'll never be bawling. Are they bouncing? Taylor Swift. Are they bouncing Sonic like a basketball? That's what? Taylor Swift. Yeah, Taylor's gotta be Swift. <laughs> when you keep making jokes about my dog ate my homework and then he actually eats it. The sacred texts. <laughs> Hindenburg. Breaking benches. Not breaking benches. Me when I see a Trump mug should meme. Conservatives when they see a Trump mug should meme. <laughs> when you post a meme in the class group chat. But then you remember the teacher is in the chat. Ooh. He's out of line, but he's right. Right. When you realize that we are closer to 2028 than 2018. Damn, you ain't have to roast me like that. 
Shit. Man, woman, white, black, poor, rich, Asian, schools that block prodigy math game. I don't know what that is, so. Objects in mirror are closer than their peer. 2024. Mine, uh, yeah, you know what? You don't have to keep reminding me of unpleasant things, okay? Because is it just me or has 2023 somehow been the longest and yet shortest year ever? I know they say when you get older, time moves more quickly, but damn, I can't, I, like, there's only three months left out of the year. That's crazy. Heaviest objects in the universe are sun, mm -hmm. neutron stars, right. black holes, my brain. <laughs> Kid, I was born in 2011. Me, realizing that was 12 years ago. I was about to say, oh, so you're like five years old. Never mind, might be. When I'm in a diarrhea competition and my opponent is Amber Heard. Me losing all my skills in CSGO after CS2 came out. Mom, if you don't study, you're gonna end up like him. The construction worker that makes twice a salary. I'm dead. They do be making money though. Plumbers? People be talking shit about plumbers. Oh, you're gonna, be, gonna become a plumber. Plumbers make fucking bank, bro. People who go to trade schools won, for real. The scariest things on earth. The dark. Mm -hmm. Clowns. Mm -hmm. Sharks. Mm -hmm. Serial killers. Okay. Death. Thank you for everything. Spend the night in Shrek's swamp. Now on Airbnb, on your feet, Why soldier. We are leaving. Why would I want to do that? T no offense, shrimps, shrimp, shrimps, swamp, Shrek's swamp was dirty and disgusting. I don't want to stay there. That's nasty. No offense. Looks real cute. Teacher, why are you laughing? Me, no reason. My brain, Sonic the Hedge. Y'all are so dumb. One hundred thousand dollars in GTA Online. Broke. $100,000 in GTA 5 story mode. That's how it is in so many games, though. In so many games, you have, like, a million dollars, and it don't mean shit. It don't mean nothing. Like, how is this possible? In real life, if I had a million dollars, I would be ecstatic. Superheroes mm. can fly, etc. Batman. <laughs> when you think the kids are asleep, and you try to slip out of the room and hear daddy. God damn it. People who vape saying it's safer. Lung cancer. <laughs> when Twilight is rewritten to be about a vampire girlfriend and muscly werewolf girl fighting for the attention of an introverted high school boy. Oh. My god. I get it. Didn't they already do this? Didn't Stephanie Meyer already do make a gender bent version of Twilight? I, fi I think she did. I'm pretty sure she did. Now, I don't know how prevalent Jacob's character is in it because it is only the first book and Jacob doesn't really play that big of a part in the first book, but... 1987 music video picture quality. Bank security camera quality in the 21st century. Bro, horrible. 4K 60fps. 1080p 240fps. Numbers, okay. America in the media. America in real life. Don't- I knew you was gonna be rude. How people who get never-ending plastic surgeries think they look. How they actually look. Mm -hmm. I always wonder about that too. Like when you look at their faces and their faces are clearly just a mass of like fillers and, and you know, surgeries and stuff like that. What do they see when they look in the mirror? And like how do they feel when they look at the rest of us who don't have all of those enhancements? I think about it a lot, actually. Anytime someone makes a meme and the younger generations don't like it. Oh no cringe. <laughs> you versus the guy she told you not to worry about. Me it. realizing how lonely I'm after watching a romance movie. Why is he crying? The girl you like. You. Her father. The boy she likes. Her ex. Her brother. <laughs> GTA pedestrians. Exist. Me. Oh no! Dipping Aureus in milk. Taking a bite of an Aurea then sipping a little milk. Putting Aureus in milk and eating it like cereal. Okay. That's basically what y'all be doing with Cookie Crisp. I don't know anybody who actually eats Cookie Crisp, but like Cookie Crisp is a cereal that exists and people eat it. So what's the difference if you do it with Oreos? Also, Oreo O's. Delicious. Such a good cereal. 
when you search a word for its definition and the name of some company or band or movie comes up. Visible frustration. <laughs> nut and cherry attracts birds like junco, nut hatch, squirrel. Squirrel? I feel like everyone needs to see this very important picture of a squirrel being hit by a sudden gust of wind. Okay. <laughs> he said, what the hell is going on here? My last brain cell during maths exam. Jack who is minus 60 feet tall and has 20,000 pineapples. <laughs> when the fake scenarios in my head start actually happening. Wow, well, that don't ever happen. My multiple personalities discussing if they should make room for a fourth. What the hell? Leaving house, good for depression, bad for anxiety. Mm -hmm. Staying at house, good for anxiety, bad for depression. Okay. Standing directly in the doorway to achieve peak mental health. Yeah, just like straddle it, like one leg on one side, one leg on the other. Alternatively, staying in your house but with the door open. This only works if you have a screen though, because otherwise people be looking all up in your house and then bugs can get in too. So, but you, you gotta have the screen. Me, my dog chilling. <laughs> Commonplace nicotine dependency in America. Millennials. Cast it into the fire. Destroy, Destroy it. it. Gen Z. No. They really won't though. Goddamn jewels and vapes done. We I feel like we were so close. We were so close. When I'm in a leaking government documents competition and my opponent is the War Thunder community. <laughs> Me walking into the exam hall knowing damn well that I'm going to fail. Damn. The boys waiting outside to see if my mom says yes to the coming in. The boys are bad. The memes I send to the group chat. The memes I save. <laughs> Me at 3 a.m. staring at the leftover McNuggets in the fridge. See, but that doesn't even sound good. Reheated McNuggets don't sound like they would taste good the texture would be off i feel like so you don't need to be looking all menacing and crazy like at these because there is not going to be good prepare yourself for disappointment younger generation makes a meme older generation oh no cringe older generation makes a meme younger generation oh no cringe yeah to be fair though i don't really think of like memes of younger generations as cringe, I just legitimately don't understand. There's like a whole subculture there that I'm not a part of because I'm old, so I don't get it, you know? When you make a dark joke and someone comments relatable. <laughs> not relatable. <laughs> Somebody left this in the middle of the road with the keys inside, so I took it. Oh no. Normal heartbeat. Deceased heartbeat. Heartbeat when you touch your pocket and don't feel your phone. Especially when it happens in a very busy public venue like a concert. I'm talking to you, Dr. D, who left her uh, phone in a bathroom while we were at Beyonce. She got it back, like, thank goodness. But I like text her like, girl, where are you? No response. Now I'm thinking my friend is kidnapped or worse. And it turns out she just left her phone in the bathroom and had to go back to get it. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to leave your reaction requests and recommendations down in the comments below. And other than that, peace out, Hope Biscuits. It's skittin' lit. <laughs>